We're gonna jump, start sucking, jump. We're gonna jump, start sucking, jump. We're gonna jump, jump, jump. We're gonna jump, jump, jump. We're gonna jump, start sucking, great. Well, hello. I didn't notice you there. You look familiar. Uh, but then again, maybe you don't. Can't tell anymore, you know. My eyes aren't what they used to be. But you're just in time. The mail truck is on its way. If you're new, just type your name on this card and I'll get you all signed up for the Jumpstart Pen Pal Club. You'll get mail from all over the United States. If you've been here before, just find your name on the list here and click. Follow me. There's an adventure underfoot. Whoa, whoa! Hey, liver lips, aren't you forgetting something? <laughs> okay, Edison, you can come too. I don't get any respect around here. We don't have all day. Bet you'd never guess there was an elevator back here. An adventurer needs to be prepared for everything. Will that be sporting goods, home appliances, or furniture? First stop, the secret clubhouse. Here we go. Welcome to our clubhouse. This is an adventurer's first stop. My name is CJ, and this is my pal, Edison. Pleased to meet you. We're here to help you out and guide you on all of your adventures. So, what are you waiting for? Let's get started. Not so fast. You forgot to mention the mail. Good thinking, Edison. There are two ways to explore, the stamps mode and the adventurer mode. You're always in the stamps mode. That means that when you succeed at any of our games or activities, you win points towards stamps. Every time you get 100 points, you win a brand new animated stamp. You can collect stamps in your own stamp book. Mr. Brewster the Mailbird will help you out. But for your convenience, we'll add this stamp to keep track of your points. That'll follow you everywhere you go. The second way to play is the adventure mode. As a Jumpstart Pen Pal, you'll get letters from kids around the country. Your pals will challenge you to a bunch of different tasks. If you solve their challenges, they'll send you really cool postcards from their home states. How about showing us a sample, Edison? If you insist. This is a map of the whole United States. There are 50 states in all. You are going to be getting letter challenges from kids just like you in all of these states. When you solve a challenge, the home state of the pen pal who sent it will light up. Like this one. That's Florida. Dear pen pal, thank you for the great picture. I am putting it on my wall at home. Your friend, Juan. Now, one Charlie, 7 November, Roger, thank you. 
Cape Canaveral in Florida includes the Kennedy Space Center, where the space shuttle blasts off. CJ already solved that challenge for you. Try to solve all the challenges and light up the whole map. To play a challenge, you'll have to wait till Mr. Brewster brings you some pen pal letters. No sooner said than done. Click on the mail room and Mr. Brewster will help you get started on an adventurous challenge. Or you can go to any fun activity and just start playing for stamp points. There's a lot you can do in the clubhouse. Edison, will you do the honors? Do I look like a tour guide? Click on the jukebox to play a new song. There's the water cooler if you want to play the bubble game. That branch will lead you to the fruit tree, where Edison will show you a game of concentration. You can take the ladder to the lookout, but that's only for the seasoned adventurer, ready to face danger and peril. The computer is there if you feel like typing anything you want. An adventurer always wants to improve. If you want to see how you're doing in a subject area, just click on the report card on the wall. Or explore the clubhouse on your own. Try clicking on anything you see. You never know what you might find. You've got some mail. Click there if you want to read your letters. Dear Pen Pal, my name is Richard. I am writing to you from Massachusetts. Last week, we played basketball in gym class. I was wondering if you could tell me how much a basketball weighs in pounds. I hope to hear from you soon. Sincerely, Richard. You can choose to work on this Pen Pal Challenge, or you can look at another. Click on the play envelope if you want to accept this challenge. You'll like that challenge. This is going to be a real adventure. An ancient myth has it that tools have been hidden away in the bone vault, buried deep beneath the school. You'll have to open it to solve the challenge. The elevator can descend deep into caverns beneath the ground. Click there when you're ready to start your challenge. There are some measuring tools in the bone vault. Why don't you try there? The Bone Vault. I wonder what could be hidden in the Bone Vault. Bones, perhaps. What's a piece of tin like this doing down here anyway? Ancient legend has it that a dog used to roam these caverns, storing all of his treasures in this vault. Nobody knows why he did it, and it's never been opened since. Well, if you don't mind that. Quick, Edison, we've got to get this opened. Get a little closer to that dial so we can see it. What do I look like? A flashlight? If you don't want to try this challenge, you can go back to the mailroom and try another. To open the bone vault, you have to use your math and spelling skills. An equation or a word with missing vowels will appear in that section. Numbers or letters will be spinning around on the dial. You mean this thing here? That's right, Edison. If you stop the dial on the right answer, a lock will open. Get all the locks open and we'll be in. To start, just click on the dial. And do you click again? I'm an explorer. Click on me. I'm a sc I'm an explorer. Click on me if you already know the ropes. I'm an explorer. You still have a letter challenge. To start, just click on the dial. You've got the double dials now. You got it! You opened another lock. Great job. You've got the double dials now. Great job.
You opened another lock. You opened another lock. You've got the double dials now. Just one more lock to go. You've got the double dials now. Great job! You did it! You opened the bone vault! Edison, inspect and secure the location. What? Oh, that's just a fancy way of saying... I'm chicken. You go first. Step aside. Do you remember which object your pen pal wanted you to weigh? You can click on the letter up there if you want to take another look. Basketball. That's four pounds. I think you solved the challenge. You did a great job. Click on the letter icon to send a reply to your pen pal. Oh, you've solved the challenge. Looks like you don't have any stamps. You'll have to play some games and activities to win some. Psst. We'll take you on an adventure. Just click on one of those... The football field. Listen to the crowd roar! Raw, raw already. Stripes and me never got along. Ah oh well. It looks like the Jumpstart football team is getting ready to play its crosstown rival. We've got to help them out. Don't want our team to lose now. We've got to do some addition here. As the team completes its plays, We'll have to add up the yardage the players gain to help them move down the field. The cheerleaders are real good at this. They'll show you what to do once we get started. So, are you ready then? Well, let's get this show on the road. Fair catch at the 15-yard line. The ball is on the 16 yard line. Nope, try it again. Nope, try it again. That's right. The ball is on the 18. Yard line. You got it. The ball is snapped, ball is handed off, rush to the 19. Yard line. That's right. Pass completed at the 39 yard line. Pass completed at the 59. Yard line. Nope. Try it again. That's right. Yeah! 
The ball is snapped, ball is handed off, rush to the 69 yard line. The ball is on the 79 yard line. You got it. The ball is snapped, ball is handed off, rush to the 89 yard line. Oh no, we got a penalty. We'll have to solve this problem in 15 seconds to avoid the penalty. You did it! Penalty denied. The jumpstart team returns to the 89 yard line. Nope. Try it again. Nope, nope, try it again. Looks like the answer's too big. That's right. That's called carrying over. Now you can add up the tens column. The blue number can stay this time, but what do you think will happen to the green number? It has to move to the hundreds column. Touchdown jump start. Ball is short. The kick is no good. And the score is jump start, six. Visitors, zero. The elevator can take us on all kinds of adventures. The boiler room. Listen, where'd you go? Oh well. The boiler room is cold and dark. Let's get our recycling done quickly. Click on that wall with the recycling bins when you're ready. Rule number three of the adventurer. Always recycle. It's good for the environment. When I pull this trash handle, be prepared for the recyclable objects to start coming out of any chute. Your job is to get the objects in the right bins. You'll have to use these pipes above me for help. Click on a pipe and drop it along the path of the object to change its direction. I'll help you get started by calling out the names of the objects. Click on the trash handle to get started. That was quite a ride. Blast! See if you can get... Keep trying. See how much you can recycle. Hardboard. Keep trying. See how much you can recycle. There's a bonus in this round. Try to redirect your object to hit the bonus and you'll get extra points. Plastic. Paper.